Alex, come closer! Ah! Ah! Go, get away! Alex, go back! Ah, ah. No, seriously, go back. Your breath kind of stinks. <laughs> That's because I've been eating out your mum. My mum's literally on holiday right now. Yeah, at f***ing my house, mate. Hello, Lewis's mum. Everyone, welcome to watching Wakey Wines until we cringe. I think this is the third time I'll be watching Wakey Wines on this channel, and that has got to be somewhat of a torture method in third world countries. Wakey Wakey, guys, it's Wakey Wines. What's the best shop in Wakey? Like, I don't know, Lidl, probably. Like, decent prices, you know, bakery. You can get some, like, you know, go to the bakery, get something like 25p. You know, I, I, I go Lidl. Or maybe Asda or Aldi, where you can actually buy Prime for less than £100. Uh, so if you don't know why Wakey Wines got famous, this is why. Hi, Grandma, you're right. Yes. <laughs> Where have you come from, love? Manchester Withenshaw. And you bought our first can for hundred pound. Come close, Abdul. She looks a bit like you, Alex. Wait, who looks like me? The granny. She looks a bit like you. Same trim. We have the same haircut. Yeah, that is true. Uh, I would argue I'm probably going grey quicker than she did. I love how it took her so long to reply at the beginning. By the way, do you reckon that's to do with her old age? Alzheimer's, maybe. Yeah. I don't think she knows where she is, Alex. <laughs> well, I think everybody shouting, "What's the best shop in Wakey?" would hopefully give her some form of sharp reminder. What's the best shop in Wiki? What? Wait, where are we? I thought I was in Luton. Why do you think Mohammed's always shouting? Because he can't hear. What's the best shop in Wiki? What did you say? What's the best shop in Wiki? Wiki words. Watermelon can, and there's the receipt. Hundred pounds she paid for it. You're a good woman. <laughs> That makes me laugh every time. You're a good woman. Me and that kid are wearing the same branded jumper. And he's looking like as well. Both short and. Mm. Oh, what was that? It's gonna say stubby. <laughs> You're not stubby. You're more like the one in the middle. He looks like he's definitely selling that to spend on FIFA points. So pretty much they were getting these prime cans and selling it for 100 pounds. You know this script by now. You know it. And you know where the best shop in Wakey is. They're not going to reply to you, mate. They're not. They, this is not an interactive video. What you don't see is actually my viewers. We have that connection. And on the other side of the screen, they're shouting, Wakey one. Oh, well, I didn't realise your audience were f***ing weird. It's like Dora the Explorer when she talks to you. That's kind of the same just my channel has. But it's some f***ing hairy Scottish bloke. Not very hairy to be fair Alex, look at my chest there, it's not very hairy. I don't really have much hair. I'm like an otter, a hairless otter. So you're not anything like an otter at all. <laughs> <laughs> you right? I'm good thank you, and you? Good thank you. <laughs> How come you out of Wakey Wines? I've got two friends from the West Midlands. That's so unfortunate. Mate, honestly, give it to him for free. Like, I, I feel bad for him. Do you know anyone from the West Midlands? I used to have a girlfriend from the West Midlands, remember? Oh, is, is it him? Yes, that's my girlfriend. He sounds like Jim from Friday Night Dinner. I've got two friends in the West Midlands. Wilson! <laughs> I haven't actually seen that show. How has this man managed to get Prime Meta Moon before me? Do you know how depressing that is? It's the best flavour as well. Have you had it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I got like a... 12 pack delivered to my flat. He looks like one of them South Park in the pandemic special. I don't know if you've seen that episode. Yeah. When you're in Wakey, Cathedral Bell chimes and it has bells. Bless you. Walk a few more steps yes. and get yourself down to Wakey Wines. I love that. I love that. I think he looks incredibly uninterested in everything he's just said. I, I, I... That was probably the most enthusiastic response anyone's ever gave him and he just doesn't care. He's almost like he's only in it for the money. Money, 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 money. He's got that Rolls Royce, doesn't he? He does. Wakey Wines. Abdul, come closer. Abdul, go back. Bingo, bingo. Bingo, bingo. <laughs> To be fair, I don't know what this whole bingo bingo thing is. No, I don't understand. Is it him trying to encourage gambling? Well, technically his shop is one big gambling app. Well, like you can just obviously scratch cards are a popular thing in like corner shops. Sure, sure. Whereas he just says Prime. I refuse to believe this man doesn't know what Prime Hydrate. I refuse to believe this man knows what Amazon Prime is, let alone Prime Hydration. Let alone hydration. Fuck, wakey, 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 Robin, bastard, Robin, all families. Six ninety nine a bottle. Come to Pontelian Road. Abdul, come closer. I'll go and f off. <laughs> Robin bastard. Cam Kirkham's changed a little bit. Come down to Bacalia Road. Come on, man. Away. Is that how Cam Kirkham sounds to you? Yes. Uh, give us your best Geordie impression. Oh, away, I man. Oh, away, I. That was. That was good. Up the tune. Up the tune. Why are you, man? Why are you? I loved how enthusiastic she was in that video. Like, I don't even think it's her shop. I think she's just a customer and she cares that much, which is just absolutely wild to me. Yes, big man, how you doing? Are you right? All right, yo. What? What? That's, that's the 
fucking mountain. Well, it's a big show. Even Kratos is struggling to get his hands on Prime, mate. He's had to travel to this realm. He's had to, he's had to travel to the Wakefield realm to get Prime. The Wakefield realm. Look at poor little Mahat. He looks like Brock from God of War. A lot of God of War references today. I fucking love God of War. Where are we going? Ready for you? Whatever you want, but you got whatever you want. His hands are huge. It's not the only thing huge about him. Look at him. He's got a massive willy. Why did you objectify him? There's no reason. Don't tell me you don't look at like at Shaquille O'Neal when you go, it's got to be like. No, I don't. It's got to be like a pogo stick. I genuinely don't. I can actually fully tell you I don't do that. Okay. Well, my intrusive thoughts get the better of me. Also, look at the way he drinks his drink. It's not Macabita, please. You get your violet now, pal. That's actually a two litre bottle. I've never seen someone eat a drink before. Just like, he just crashes the can in, eats the can. <laughs> mm. Protein. Like Stone Cold Steve Austin just smashing it off his head. It looks a bit like um the character from the Goonies. Hey you guys! What's the best shop you work, eh? Work you wise! Abdul come closer! Abdul, go back. Abdul's feeling for his life. Whatever you say, Daddy. Uh, Abdul's like, I'm not coming closer this time. Like, I'm staying as far back as I possibly can. That man's got to be, like, seven foot. Yeah, he's, like, seven foot two. Which means he's probably got, like, a life expectancy of, like, 30 years. Oh, bless him. This is what drinking Prime does to your body. It's like radiation. I'm pretty sure young blood is from Wakefield, you know? So there's a lot. Also, so this guy, by the way, I think he is the Wakey Wines bouncer. Yes, look what you're doing at your eye. Why are we in, like, a grime music video? Why is it shot so? nice because he's got a new 4k camera but i prefer just the android videos if i'm honest it gave that raw wakefield energy to it this has got like a color grade on it i know it feels like it's in los angeles not wakefield bring it back yeah what's going on i'm gonna color grade my camera to look like that for this video he's got security and a 4k camera now moving up in the world and the rolls royce i'm all right so this man's just standing in the back man but all he does now is just promote his new drink operate which i kind of i kind of rate he just nabbed it he doesn't even sell prime anymore he probably does. How you doing? Are you alright? I'm good. How are you, boss? Good, thank you. Where have you come from? <laughs> Fagley must be D2. Sorry. <laughs> Listen to that again. What's the best shop in Wakey? Wakey Wine. Do you know that? Mate, how are you not? How are you not embarrassed? Like when you pretend to talk like that? Like I, I, I've never understood it. I don't get it. Friends used to talk like that at home, and I was be like, we're from Bournemouth, mate. Like <laughs> fucking real. Like mate, really in. For the love of God. I've never heard someone speak in ad libs before. It reminds me of that X Factor edition, you know. Come on, move your body. Come on, move your body. Oh, mysterious girl, move your body close to mine. Come on, move your body. That's how he's speaking. Wakey, why did you know that? <laughs> Bro's stuck in a rap song. I've got to go back. Whack. Whack. I've never had somebody pronounce the Y in back before. Abdul, go. He definitely says the M word. Someone said he's got the Bradford MC voice. Yes to the B, to the 1, to the 3. He's got that MC accent. York. How could we come all the way from York? I've been there. Did you go to Wakefield Wines? No, it's not in York. I just full named him. I'm not sure why. That. Wakefield wines only when they're in trouble. Wakefield wines only when you're scamming children, which is every day. Choppy wakey. Wakey wine. Wakey wine. Bingo, bingo. Look over there. Bingo, bingo. They're being held hostage. He's poor. These little Yorkies have been held hostage at Wake Wine. Siblings or Dayton? Dating. Dayton, you think so? Steve Lovely, couple have come all the way from York. Told you. He didn't even get Abdul come closer. It just got cut short. Go to Asda. It's two pound. <laughs> Where have you come from, guys? London. How many hours was it? Four hours. What made you come to Shaky Wakey? What? Shaky Wakey. <laughs> what made you come here, Prime? More like Flaky Wakey. Flaky Wines. You get it? Prime and our sweet and, and <laughs> Japanese yeah. Fanta, yeah? He's wearing that Snapshot Eye type t-shirt. He is. Maybe inspiration. Collab. I'm pretty sure him and Paul Breach are the same age, which says a lot about society. It says a lot about their generation. When you get to age 40, you either go down the lane of Paul Breach or down the lane of Mohammed Wakey Wines Man. The only two options. What's the best shopping week, eh? Wakey Wines! Abdul, come closer. Abdul, go back. Abdul didn't do either. Is Abdul okay? Bless him. He didn't feel like coming forward or going back today. Did his knee in. Doing it so many times, and now he's just out for injury. He's actually just got him tied down, just filming for life. Bingo, bingo! That was the most aggressive bingo, bingo yet, I think. And he, I don't think he even got a gala bingo in return there, did he? Gala bingo! Was that worth the four hours, woman? Was that worth the four hours she drove in the car? I believe it's because the little guy on the left, I believe he's a TikToker. The little guy on the left? You mean the child? <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
He stopped filming for a minute. Oh my god, so they've got bouncers asking them to stop filming outside. The size of the bouncer at Wakey Wines protecting the prize. <laughs> that bouncer ain't got nothing on him. He's going to clear that bouncer f out, mate. He's going to clear him out. He's cosplaying a blind person. So I don't know if you've seen this, but he's been making money in more than one way. No way. No, there's no way. Oh, yeah, baby. I'm going to pop some tags. I got $20 in my pocket. Come on, say it with us. What's the best be Wakey, way. Wakey, way. Nice. As a hashtag influencer, there's one thing I've always said I'll never do, and that is a club appearance. No matter how famous I am, or no matter how much money they offer me, I will never, ever, ever do a club appearance. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. He reminds me of one of the rats from Flushed Away. Have you seen what song they were playing in the nightclub? What's the best song be wearing? Yeah, I'm I think that all electronic producers should be hung, drawn, and quartered. That's not very nice. I want this song played at my funeral, and I want you to choreograph the dances. It's Fred again. Yeah, this was Fred again, did it? Banger. Yeah, it would actually slap. <laughs> This was actually the adverts that they made for the nightclub. First of all, look at that first one. Who is that guy? That's a boxing match. Yeah, Abdu was fighting on Misfits 005 against Paul Breach. God, I fucking love that. Same weight class, same age. To be fair, Paul Breach and Muhammad from Wakey Wines are both in the age demographic of Jake Paul. I can't believe anybody, like, would go to a club where these people could possibly be paid to go. Like, it's it, it's the same type of people like go to a prison or whatever. It's like, what's going on? Well, I'm very confused about is look at the other one Prime Party with Azar and Abdu. I thought his name was Muhammad. Is Azar like his stage name? I was never really too sure if his name was Muhammad because I never heard him me mention it. I just I just assumed based on everybody else calling that. But then in hindsight, what if all this time it's just been some horrific racial stereotype that everybody has just perpetuated? No, I see I see the articles unless they were just calling him Muhammad. Unless the British press is racist, which could never be the case. That would never happen, guys. Just like Paul Breach has done his tours around UK train stations, he's been doing his tours around UK corner shops. What, like, like to teach them how to run a corner shop as good as him? I think he just goes in there and just shouts. I think he just does what's the best shop and then just repeats the shop. Yes, boys, how you doing? Are you all right? We're all right. Where have you come from? What made you come to Snack Attack? What's the best shop be wake, eh? Wakey wise. Abdul, come closer. Abdul, get back. Get back? Gonna have us. That's horrible. Is that a threat? Get back behind the counter where you belong. You know what's gonna happen, mate, if you come closer. To be fair, they deal with the type of guys that I would be like, okay, I will get back. And look, Big Show just there in the background, if you, you did not see him next to the yellow. He kind of stands out a bit. Yeah, and he also looks very similar to the yellow M&M right next to him. Is that all that is? Yeah. It's snack attack, mate. It doesn't have the same ring to it, does it? Snack attack. No, not. It doesn't. <laughs> What's the best shop in Birmingham? None. The Bull Ring, I think. The only shop in Birmingham. What's the only shop left standing in Birmingham after the Great War? Snack attack! Every Birmingham resident eats here. To be fair, it is quite wholesome that people love him in public, whereas Paul Breach just gets abused. Yeah, yeah, he's got, he's got like a positive fan base. Yeah, and they respect him quite clearly. Boss man gone on tour. The first boss man to ever do a corner shop tour. The biggest boss man. The boss of all boss men. To be fair, he is, isn't it? He technically is like the boss man of England. Oh, he's the king. He's the king of boss men. That's undeniable that he is. He could like be a consultancy for any other corner shop now. Like, he's just, he's the king. It actually blows my mind like how popular he is. I don't know if you've seen this, but they're now selling a new liquid. Do you know what it is? A new liquid. It's water. That's not a new liquid. It's been around forever. True. But uh, so is Prime. <laughs> no, it hasn't. Prime, Prime has not been around forever. Prime has been there since the dawn of dinosaurs. No, it's not. It's not true. You're gaslighting me. No, that's not true. My favourite water, my best seller in my shop, Mr. T's water. So we've got 10 cases in. So come on, get it. What do you think, Abdul? That's nice, Rick. Banging in it, pal. Yeah. 
And we've got our sweet. Can you have a guess at how much a bottle of water is? Please, please guess. One pound eight. Fifteen pounds. What? Fourteen pound ninety-nine he is charging people to survive. Is that a crime against God? Mr. T's tap water. Wait, it's, it's Mr. T as in like the Mr. T like, oh, I spit in the face of people who are not cool. Or, or, or is that Carlito? It was that Mr. T, was it? That was Mr. T. I need to get some water because i am so dehydrated you need some water but well, look no further 14.99 get mr t's water bottle i spit it in the face i'm putting a genuine order in here i thought you could ask me to get some prime hydration which also no oh so low ed or no i know you love transforming me into people maybe don't make me into mr t <laughs> Surely he'd be better off just selling his own piss. How much would you buy for that? What's the lo what's the sentence there? What's the logic? I I just I don't really know at this point. I'm I'm kind of delirious from all these Wakey Wines videos. And this is another meter great which I absolutely adore. What the f is that a red carpet? Yes, and if you listen closely, it sounds like he's in a construction site. Right, everybody, my van broke down. I'm catching a taxi. I'm in cash and carry today. I'm in the shop tomorrow. Cash and carry? Surely he's got to be the first person to do a meeting group in cash and carry. Twelve o'clock till six o'clock. So if you want to come down for a picture of the video, you're more than welcome. But in my bio, you can click in there now. We've uh, downloaded a cameo app. Cameo! Okay, we know how much Paul breaches is. How much do you think Wakey Wine's cameo is? Come on. Five grand. Surely the maximum computer is like 500, no? How much do you think? How much do you think? Michael Essien was like two grand a cameo. I'm going to guess 30 pounds. I love how you just didn't care about the fact that Michael Essien was on cameo. I really don't care. 28! I was fairly close. That's reasonable. Should I buy it? I feel like it's a waste if you don't at some point. Okay, we'll do it. Guys, if this video hits 8,942 likes, I'll buy a Wakey Wine's cameo. That's a good deal, guys. For 28 quid, that's a good deal. Yes, ma'am, how you doing? Love, are you right? Yeah, you are. Good, thank you. What made you come to Snack Attack? Hopper right. What are you come for, son? WFD uh, sweets. WFD sweets, yeah? What's the best shop in Wakey? Wakey, why? I've still come closer. <laughs> bingo, bingo. Bingo. Ah, oh, so I can't lie, I can't do this anymore. I hate Wakefield. I'm alright with that I am stuck in.